So today is day five or day six. And we don't know how to count it. I don't know how to count it. I'm going to keep so, saying day five though. He says day five. I say it's day six. Anyway, so today we actually left and hit the road. We're in um, nowhere, Kansas. Uh, um, what is it? What, I don't even. Uh, Oscar, Oscar, Oscar Luigi. I don't even know. <laughs> not <laughs> we're, even close. We're about uh, like, 30 minutes uh, east of. It's like Katusa with an Oscar. That's what somebody said on my Facebook. Yeah. We're 30 minutes east of uh, the capital. Whatever the capital is. There you go. Um, I, so this park we're at is actually. Mm, it's by a lake. But it's not by a lake. Yeah, it's not it's by actually kind of. I'm glad we're just here for the night. Yeah. Uh, I would rate it as uh, better than a Walmart parking lot. I mean, we have a uh, <laughs> we have a 30 amp plug in today, so we can't use both of our air conditioners. Darn. <laughs> well, and it's also like there's like some kind of like swamp, like uh, 50 yeah, yards from here. There's a couple of mosquitoes outside. I went and, outside. It was bad. Um. So yeah. Uh, day one, pretty good. Uh, we are on our way to Winterset, Iowa tomorrow, tomorrow. Yep. Uh, to stay with some family. Uh, but today we went four and a half hours, 220 200 miles. miles, although it would have been shorter if I had actually, um, hit the correct settings on uh, Google maps. So normally for this thing, avoiding the tolls is kind of a must because I don't even want to think about how much it's going to cost. But I accidentally hit avoid the highways too. So, oh, we were halfway through Kansas and all of a sudden Google's like, take a right turn. I'm like, oh, okay, sure, why not? That's the way we're supposed to go. And I go down this road and it gets narrower and narrower. It's take a left turn and it gets narrower and narrower. And all of a sudden there's no road. It's just gravel and there's a, there's a hill that goes up like this. And uh... so I was driving behind him <laughs> And my GPS was like, stay on this road. And Corey would turn <laughs> off of it. And I'm like, okay, well, maybe he knows something I don't. Like, there's a low bridge or something on this road. And that kept happening until you kept going we were on a gravel road. And I was behind him. And he was going up a gravel road in this Class A RV. So I actually stopped at the bottom of this really... I think I got down to do, like, three mile an hour up this hill because it just, it was steep. It was and it, it was steep and it was wet, and I have about eh, twenty thousand pounds <laughs> underneath me. So. so I waited until he got up the hill before I even attempted to follow. Um, let's we're gonna try to stay on the highways. Yeah. Um, but so, hey, we got to see some pretty scenery. So Corey also jumped over some railroad tracks going way. <laughs> way too fast see i thought i was slowing down just enough but it was also a uh, no engine brake zone so i'm like all right i'm just going to kind of you we know had a cop right behind me i don't know if you knew that oh i'm really glad so, i didn't hit the engine brakes so i was then. sitting there like praying i was like dear jesus tell Corey not to hit the engine brake because we're going through a town in which that is illegal and i don't want to yeah. have like day one and a ticket because like uh, through all those back farm roads i'd been riding the engine brake because it was up and down and all that so it was like i turned it off when we got into town i was like okay so i'll just go over these railroad tracks no problem they were a lot uh, bumpier than i had imagined so i'm in my little prius and all i see is you know the rv <laughs> and i was like well it sounded well? like a war zone in here <laughs> so we got back uh cory's gonna put a picture up but uh all was, of the clothes that were on hangers I, were no all, longer hanging up all the work just that i've done over the past pile, four days was pile of clothes pointless Sorry. <laughs> um, anyway, so we're not going to worry about fixing all of that until we get to where we're going to stay for a couple weeks. Mm -hmm. um, just gonna, I'm just going to get some stuff hung up tonight and fix my mistake there. Um, just get it on, off, you know, off the pile and then hanging up again. Uh, the last thing is I think uh, we got our Wii Boost set up. It I, works for Verizon, but not for Sprite. We're also kind of in a hole. Um so like there's a lake around us and we're kind of like on this peninsula and we're in a valley in the peninsula. So yeah, we're not going to get the greatest service, service. but I have it like Jerry rigged with zip ties and some tape. The Wi-Fi kind of... uh, at the park though is actually a lot better than the Wi-Fi we had in Ulaga. That so. is. 
Um, so right now we're just kind of working off of Wi-Fi Verizon, kind of bouncing some stuff off of it. and. So I got to go done. finish my work for the day. I still have about a couple hours worth of work to get done. I'll help you a little bit. So anyway, yeah, that's day five. Or six. Or six. <laughs> Oh. oh, wrong way. Oh, that's why. <laughs> there we go. 